Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Los Alamitos Quarter Horse, nighttime quarter horse program here on Friday. It is September the 23rd, 2016. We're going to look at races one and seven, races one and seven. Before we get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5 for more selections. So let's get on to it, starting off with race number one from the nighttime quarter horse racing from Los Al. It's a claiming race, purse $8,000 for three year olds, which have. Um, and upward, which have never won two races, um, downwards a race since uh, July 23rd, um, allowed three pounds. So there's a claim price 2,500 here. Um, we have a field of seven horses traveling the distance of ground of four and a half furlongs. Four and a half. And my top selection here will go to the two horse, number two, Storm and Trick. I'm going to go. Two three five seven two three five seven number two storm and trick eight five Ramon Guse is in the saddle last time out run at Los Al daytime program five and a half long September eighth and uh, claiming eight thousand so it's been six by sixteen lengths that day you know is stepping down to a uh, lower class today got blinkers his last two starts getting blinkers off today I think that's the key his last two races were horrible you know he finished six by sixteen lengths he beat two horses he just weakened a very disappointing run by him that day. Start before six frongs and claim fourteen thousand at Del Mar, no, it's twenty eighth. Source finished six by six and a quarter lengths with blinkers on for the first time ever, and again he just weak and did not like the blinkers that day. And then a twelve and a half uh, Del Mar claimer, five and a half frongs on uh, August fourteenth. Source finished six by ten and a quarter lengths that day behind Overcomer, who the horse got beat by two starts in a row. He just weakened again. It wasn't his best of runs. For this horse's last win, we have to go to a claim in 12.50 at San Nita, June the 11th, five and a half furlong. This horse won by six and three quarter lengths, almost on the lead all throughout, and had a very nice run. You know, Steve Knapp sending this one in to run here today, four and two at the current meet at Los Al, with a 50% win strike um, rate. 75% of the time, this horse is, uh, his horses are in the money also. He's one second place finish. Uh, one horse uh, did not finish in the money. But I think this horse has a very strong chance. He's very speedy here. Uh, it's dropping down a lot of class. You know, watch out for this horse to have a very good run. So to recap my bets for race number one from Los Alamitos, going to go with the two horse, Storm and Trick. Going to go two, three, five, seven, two, three, five, seven. So now let's get on to race number seven from Los Alamitos. Nighttime program again. Hopefully you get that. Seventh race from Los Alamitos is an allowance race. Purse $12,600. The Phillies two-year-old just never won two races. Field of seven horses traveling 350 yards down the straightaway. And uh, my top selection here will go to... If we can lower that. Uh, if uh, My top selection here in race seven from Los Alamitos will go to the two-horse Fusability. I'm going to go 2573. 2573. Number two Fusability, 4 to 1 for Paul Jones, who trains this one. Last time out, he's coming out of a $45,000 stakes race on August 20th here at Los Al, 350 yards. This horse finished fifth by two lengths that day. But through the uh, disqualification, this horse was placed uh, ninth. And at 37 to 1, this horse. Um, it just uh, was going out, out, and out, and out, and that's why the reason for the disqualification was, uh, you know, so I really don't want to really judge that race because he, he interfered with a few horses that day from the uh, seven hole. Start before came um, at Low Sal and August the six three hundred fifty yards in a trial for 4,000. This horse finished second by uh, one through quarter lengths, finishing the trial in 17.86 for that race. You know, he just uh, broke. His horse has a bad thing of breaking in and out, you know. I would like to see this horse um, break cleanly. If this horse breaks clean, I think this horse has a very strong chance of winning. You know, his last few starts, um, you know, his start before that, he shifted in at the start, um, got bumped from the, the seven hole. His last start from the two hole and a trial on May the 1st at low south, 300 yards. His horse finished third by three quarters of length. You know, he, uh, from the two hole, he broke a little good. He, he, he was breaking a lot better than he did in starts after that, but he just, just missed the second place finish behind that. Good reason. He was a winner next start out. And he broke his main here at low south in the 8,500 claiming race. Um, made an 8,500 claim or whatever you want to call it in Los Al on April 16th. Horse won by half length. You know, it was just a very good victory. A little bit, you know, it was shifting out a little bit, but it was a decent victory. So going to go with this one here. So to recap my bets for race number seven from Los Alamitos, quarter horse. Going to go with the two horse here, Fusability. Going to go 2573, 2573. So good luck to all and follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5 Good luck, everybody.